All right, guys, just a quick video today. We're going to see what kind of results we get. And a PV120 from Bluetti versus the Bluetti PV68. All right. It's a little afternoon here in the middle of January in Texas. The skies are not awesome, but we do have some sun. I'm gonna be charging the Bluetti EB3A, which uh, I was draining some of the power out of to do this test and forgot about it, and now it's at zero percent. So. Under those circumstances, we're going to see what happens. Stand by. All right, we're going to do the uh, PB120 first. Both of these are set at 45 degrees. And here we go. Struggling to get power in this in this sun with these clouds. But you know, we're doing what we can. Also the battery's at zero percent. So I'm gonna go ahead and check the other panel real quick while it's still at zero percent. And then we're going to see what happens when it gets a little bit of juice in it. Alright, so now we're going to try the PV68. This is still at 0%. And the sun's coming out stronger right now. But... I am getting 60 watts. The sun is definitely coming out a little brighter right now. 60 watts. All right. So I'm going to switch back to the other one real quick. We'll see what happens. All right, so we're back on the PV120 since the sun came out. I'm trying to keep it there-ish. And at 117. So, looks like about same results I got last time with this panel and this kind of sun. Really good, 116, 117. And uh, the other one was getting 60, so it's pretty good. We'll see if it gets any better when I get some juice in it. All right, so we got 5% in it now. Sun's doing whatever it's going to do. All right. So the PV120 right now is doing 107, and we're going to switch over to the PV68 and see what it's doing. And then we're going to call it a day. All right, so we're on the PV-68 now. Sun's still doing the same thing. It's only been a couple of seconds. Oh, this is hard to film. We get about 52, 53. So oh, there you go. It's basically half the panel, like you know, you probably figured. Thanks a lot. Okay, here's a little bonus footage. I'm doing the same thing I did last time. Disconnected my two 100 watt energy panels that are on the roof, running in parallel. Plug it into here. 
and the same sky conditions I'm getting 132 that's 200 that's 200 watt but two 100 watt energy panels in 132 so the uh, blue Eddy panels continue to impress thanks for watching